a nice and chilly morning from across the border. It's been a minute since I last did some climbing in the Western Julian Alps here in Italy. So it's about time I do some more. It's been a bit rainy for the past couple of days, so everything's feeling super fresh and the temperature is just about perfect for hiking. Well, at least as long as I'm below the sun level. <laughs> Looks like the path got washed away. I guess we'll have to improvise. Oops. <laughs> Holy moly macaroni. Would you look at that view? Today's topic I want to talk about is social media. As some of you already know, I've recently deleted all of my social media accounts and I've already shared my thoughts on that matter in the community page of my channel. But I know not everyone follows along with my rambling posts, so I might as well say a few words here in today's video. But first, let me show you where we're headed. So there's five peaks here that basically look like a crown from the other side. And today we'll be climbing these two, which are also the highest of the five. Uh, how much more of these trees is there gonna be? Look at this poor cottage. Not much left from it. Soon there won't be anything left other than a pile of dirt. Okay, back to my rambling. So, I've been wanting to do that for a long time now, but never actually did it. And now, when I finally did, it feels so much better. <laughs> I always felt like it was just taking away my precious time and could never find any real value from it. Especially now with all of the short forum content I feel like it all went downhill. The algorithms are designed to keep you scrolling for as long as possible and there really is no end to it. What a lovely little hut. Since we're here, we might as well check out the inside. Okay, this, this side is locked. Let's check out the other side. storage room and that's the bedroom Oops. Oh. Not 
not too shabby. I definitely like to return here in the winter and spend the night. Well, I just hope there aren't any mice in here. <laughs> Otherwise, that's a no-go. a closer look at the wall and now I've got two options either you take the left route up here or the right one up here <laughs> another rotting cut so peaceful up here can't hear anything other than birds and nature. I think I've decided to take the left route up and the right one and way down. That way it's a nice complete circle. And that's where the climbing begins, up here. Of course, that's also where we put our helmets on. I'm gonna change this for this. Brought way too much water with me, so had to go. As I was saying about the social media thing, I just needed to silence out all of the external noise and focus on myself more. Especially now, while I'm trying to fix all of my health issues. You know, it takes extra time and energy to do that. Once I got rid of all that nonsense, I realized there's a big part of my brain I never really paid any attention to. And that I've got a lot more to learn about my myself than I thought. Improving a lot of mental aspects. Yeah, it was a humble new beginning. Uh, holy shit. I almost ran into this ginormous, disgusting spider. Can't complain about the weather today. Nice and sunny, not too hot, and just the right amount of wind so we don't overheat. Easy way around or just straight up? Is that even a question? Quiet is pretty decent, so we can enjoy ourselves a bit. You 
you can't really get to know yourself if you're always flooded with a bunch of useless information from the moment you wake up and until you go back to bed. Sometimes you just have to be alone with yourself, just you and your inner voice, because then you'll realize your inner voice is talking to you pretty much all day, every day. And if you always obey it, then you're not really living life to the fullest potential, because your mind will usually always look for the easiest way out, and that's what holds back most people including me What have I gotten myself into? <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, next time you're bored, instead of scrolling your boredom away, rather have a deep down conversation with yourself and you'll realize there's a lot more to your mind than you could ever imagine. Okay, I think that should be the top. And that's the finish line. Well, kind of. Still have to climb the first one and the highest of the five. So, we're not done just yet. Orange juice and the sandwich. What more could a man want? <laughs> This city down here is called the Ghost Town. It used to be quite a decently sized mining town, especially during the war. But once all of the mines closed in the 90s, most of the people left and now you'll barely find anyone down there. You can see this whole side of the mountain is covered with mines. And down there was the headquarters. Alright, let's continue. Short descent down here, some bushwhacking and back up. Of course, you don't have to delete social media because of me. If you find some value from it, then awesome, don't delete it. But at least try to set a limit on how much and when you use it. <laughs> 
but my hands all sticky now. <laughs> Up there, let's say in the morning, don't let social media be the first thing to occupy your mind. I'd rather take a few minutes to relax and maybe plan your day a bit or have some positive thoughts instead of letting your mind be overrun by all of the useless information online. Also in the evening, don't end your day scrolling through Instagram reels or TikToks pick up a book instead and do some reading or reflect on your day a bit and promise you'll feel way more energized and you'll be way more productive that way and that is Mero Uno Well, by the looks of it, I think that peak is higher, so that's probably the, the top of the two. Let's just switch the summit real quick, and then we're set. Whew. There we go. Yeah. Considering there's a booklet here, that's probably the official summit. Now I can officially say my job is done and can start descending back into the valley. What do we have here? A rope. Well, that's definitely gonna come in handy. Whoop. I think I was gonna be doing canyoning today. And you're out. Just like that. Well, looks like I went off course a bit. <laughs> Made it down in one piece. I've got a smooth road to the valley. Well, you could argue and say it's the same thing with YouTube. And you're right, it can be if you don't limit your time on the app properly. But me personally, I find a lot of value from YouTube. That's why I'm probably never gonna stop watching it and posting, of course. Fujio Cinque Punte, till next time. So yeah, for now you can only find me on YouTube or Patreon. Of course the link is in the description. But in the future I think I might also make a Discord. Ooh, what the heck was that? It's an enormous bug. <laughs> What was I about to say? Oh yeah, in the future I might also make a Discord server. I think it would be a nice way to connect and share some climbing tips and tricks. Maybe some information about routes. If you're interested, let me know and we'll make it happen. But other than that, I think that's about it for today. Hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next one.